What's up, everybody? It's your boy, Mr. Duga, coming at y'all with another episode of Drop It Dimes with Mr. Duga. <laughs> and today I'm going to talk about the Philadelphia Eagles have granted cornerback Darius Slade's agent, Drew Rosenhaus, permission to seek a trade. Um, before I get into this video, for everyone, if you want to give me a follow on my social media platforms, I'm going to have all that information down in the description box. May not always get a chance to respond to questions and comments on these videos, so feel free to DM me. Whenever I get a chance to, I'll get back at you. Come holla at your boy. Also, if you are Madden play on Xbox One, I'll have my Xbox One gamer tag in the description box also. Um, Eagles grant Darius Slay permission to seek a trade. Basically, this has a lot to do with salary cap implications. Um, Darius Slay gonna have the biggest cap hit on the team uh, next season with a twenty-six point one million dollar cap hit. Um, the Eagles, what the Eagles really, basically, what this come down to is Darius Slay willing to restructure his contract. If Darius Slade does not want to restructure his contract, which he has the right to not want to do that, obviously it's his money, then I think the Eagles will indeed try to trade him. Um, but if he is willing to restructure his contract, I think he'll remain a Philadelphia Eagles, which um, all indications say that's what the Eagles are really hoping happens. Uh, look, Slade, you know, uh, was a pro bowler this season. Um, I, but for me, obviously he was great early this year. Um, this year, he ended up with 14 passes, defense, three picks. But for me, he was outstanding um, early in the year, like the first half of the season, especially that Minnesota Vikings Monday night game when he pretty much shut down Justin Jefferson um, and had two interceptions in that game. And he was NFC Defensive Player of the Week for his performance that night. And that was that looked like that was springboarding him to be probably the best cover corner in all of football last season. And like I said, he played well early in the year. But to me, as the year went on, his play, his, uh, his play dipped a little bit. Um, against the commanders that second game, Terry McLaurin got after him a little bit. Um, you know, and just, just other games, man, he didn't really. Dallas game, nobody played well in the secondary. Um, the second Dallas game. And then you think about in the Super Bowl, he he blew a coverage. You know, he blew a coverage in the Super Bowl, blew a coverage against Chicago. And look, I know I'm pretty much nitpicking here. No corner is absolutely perfect. Um, me personally, I want Darius Slay to stay. Um, you know, I love his I love his personality, I love his confidence, I love his skill set in this game. Um, you know, he's a captain on the defense. I want him to stay. But at the same time, man, if they move him, but now nah, you can't lose him and Bradbury. If you do trade Slade, you got to pay Bradbury what he wants. Um, look, I've dealt with, e being an Eagles fan, i dealt with so many years where we had terrible cornerbacks, the Namdi Asamoahs, Byron Maxwells, um, you know, the Kerry Williams, the, um, uh, what's his name, the, uh, the one that was on the opposite side of Kerry Williams uh, that got lit up by Dez Bryant on a Sunday night against Dallas. I've dealt with some really, really bad cornerbacks, man, play. So... You know, we got to at least keep one of these guys. I understand it's hard to pay two corners. Um, you know, you got so much other aspects of your team, especially also when you have the tent pick in the draft, when you could use that selection on a young up-and-coming um, cornerback. But uh, you can't lose both of them. Um, me personally, like I say, um, I think we do lose. If we do um, restructure Slay, I think we lose Bradbury. If we trade Slay, I think we keep Bradbury. So we're going to see how that go. But um, Darius Slay played dipped a little bit, you know, toward the second half of this season. Um, was really good before that. Was really good the year before that. His first year with us, he was kind of so-so. But um, guy's one of the better, most respected cornerbacks in the league, man. So um, I hope personally um, he restructures his deal. But at the same time, as a man, I understand you want to get all your coins. And I can't tell you to not want to get all your coins or have hard feelings towards you for wanting to get all your money. So we're going to see what happens. We're going to see what happens. Um, hopefully how it works is magic and we keep slay. Uh, but with that being said, that's all I got for y'all today. Appreciate y'all checking out the video. Hit the like button for your boy. Give me a subscribe. I have Philadelphia Eagles, NFL, and content on my other teams throughout the year. Y'all have a blessed one. Fly Eagles fly.